drop everything and forget whatever that you thought was important. There's real stuff out there making the rounds today, and we're gonna talk about it. And just like a baby duckling to a herd of lawnmowers, I'm gonna throw this topic out, Donald Trump. The weekend is over and things were decidedly quieter for the GOP presidential candidate, Donald Trump. I love Trump, he's the best. I want him to be president. Trump is jumping in the fray and just flat out punching people in the face. After telling news outlet that the Iran deal is naive and that by signing it, the president will, quote, take the Israelis and march them to the door of the oven, the internet lost its ever-loving mind. People are trying to act as if Huckabee's comments are somehow insane or unhinged. What's insane and unhinged is this deal. I cannot even believe this is happening, and this is probably why I'm a slightly cranky, because I have to defend Mike Huckabee. I don't like defending Mike Huckabee. Ration your rage, because we have a long way to go. So the media is in an absolute feeding frenzy. You're already aware of the videos that have been slow released by this group called Center for Medical Progress. A third undercover video of Planned Parenthood has come out and hold on to your butts because what it shows is nothing less than shocking. And Nina, what I think is amazing is that a lot of Americans actually who are pro-choice look at this and say, yeah, yeah, I'm okay with that. Over the years, these people have been trained to believe these aren't babies. These are just, it's just tissue, it's just cells. David Daleiden is the project lead from the Center for Medical Progress, the man behind the Planned Parenthood undercover videos. Should we gird our loins? How much worse does it get? I'm, I'm sad to say, I'm not happy to say it. it, it does get worse, Dana. Tell us about this, this loophole that you say that Planned Parenthood is trying to slip through in order to say that everything that they're doing is above board. So what Planned Parenthood is doing is they are essentially saying, well, we're gonna charge $200 per specimen, baby, um, and then we're going to, as long as we, you know, code it under these right, uh, these, these correct terms, then the law says that what we're doing is completely legal. It has to stop. The abortion industry has had the upper hand for so long, decades, in fact, and now it seems they're finally scared. Good.